Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll go through how to make a nice navigation on your internet site using these things. They're called the promoted links. So, as you see, I have a blank internet site here with just three added apps here. I have document libraries for regulations, specifications, and expense reports. So I want to make it very easy for my users to be able to see these three links here. Of course, they're there in the navigation. I can move them around as I've shown in other videos, but I want to make use of this nice UI here. Just remove this and then add another list of promoted links. I'm going to do that by clicking add an app. and I'm going to search for promoted. There's the promoted links. I'm going to call that list the home page links. I don't want that to be visible on the quick launch there. And actually I can move these out. Oh there we go. A bit nicer. Anyhow, now I'm going to go into this home page links. Go to the all promoted links view, to the edit mode here, and put the title in regulations. I'm just going to copy that shortcut. There we go. Paste that. There I have one of those. And next I'm going to copy that shortcut. Paste that there. Shortcut. There we go. So let's look at how that's going to look now. The tiles looks rather nice, right? But we do need an image also, but I'm going to put that in later. First, I'm going to go in on the home page and actually put those links here. I do that by editing the page and then inserting an app part. I'm going to use this one, the home page links, of course. I'm going to add that there. And as you see, they're there looking good. The only thing I want to do now is edit the web part to make sure it doesn't have that home page link section there. But under appearance, type none. I think that looks best. And then I'm going to apply that and then save. Now I have the, these links here pointing to my document libraries. All right, to make this a bit prettier now, I have two options. Either I try to download the images image, and I'm going to search for an icon with expenses. And here's the search tools. They're very useful. One thing I can do is say that I actually want images that are labeled for reuse. So I don't have to pay for them. And I also want them to be in the specific size that I want. Expenses didn't find anything. Well, let's try with the relations. So let's use this um, lady here. I'm just going to click on that link there and view the image. And then I'm just going to save that. Now, of course, I want to save that into my site assets. And the site assets of the site are right here. Site assets. So I'm going to go ahead and um, copy that link there. This is the one I want. Link there. So now I'm going to save this. Save picture as. Oh, sorry. I want to paste that link there. That should work much better. And okay, I guess that works. Yeah, let's use that one. Get the picture else. Same thing, I don't want to save that as an SVG. Let's have that as a PNG. The regulations specification. Now the final one, the um, expenses, it wasn't an, a free picture available on the internet. So let's uh, create one of our own now. I'm going to do that in PowerPoint. One of my favorite editing tools. PowerPoint is really good at doing lots of things. I'm going to start with a blank presentation. And of course, now I want this to be specific, a specific site, the 150. You can do that here too. And as you see, it 
it specifies it in inches now. That's not what I want. I want custom. There we go. And I want it actually to be in pixels. The interesting thing here is that you can actually type that in. And it will translate that to inches for me. It's a rather cool feature. And now I have that. And I'll just ensure fit. There we go. And now, of course, I can play around with the all the PowerPoint features, like this, the black one sounds good. And the one I wanted to do now was expense. All right, and of course I could play around with it for a long time. I don't want to bore you with that. Start over now. I have completed this logo and um, or this um, tile here. I'm just going to go ahead and save this now. Save as. I'll just put it on my desktop for now. And I'm going to save it as a PNG file. Call it expenses. Save. Just this one. Let's pull that one in. There we go. To the side assets. There we go. I'm going to pull that one in. Expenses like that. Now, here we go. So now I'm going to put my side assets side by side with my homepage links. There we go. And now I'm just going to uh, copy this, these shortcuts here and put them in the background location there. So each and every image has their specific picture. So let's go to the tiles, and here we go. It's regulations, specifications, and expense reports. And of course, on the home page now, we have these links. Very visual, very understandable. Of course, you can do more work on the images, but I think you understand the point of what I'm trying to show here. Thank you for watching this demonstration.